And with all this beautiful weather, more people will be using those walkways in the coming days for sure. Chief Meteorologist Albert Ramon. Back in our first alert weather center, Albert, it's really starting to feel like spring. No kidding, 63 degrees today. That's 17 degrees above average for this time of the year. All thanks to a wind out of the southwest, but a bit cooler tomorrow, especially if you're near the lake because of this front that stretched right across the area. This will allow for more of a northeast wind tomorrow, wind off the lake. Pretty big temperature difference with this front already. It's 36 in Waukegan versus 53 degrees in Joliet. It's 42 at Midway, 38 right now at O'Hare. And you can pick out where the front is with the winds out of the northeast from DeKalb to Aurora to Midway to Gary to now Valparaiso. Starting to see those winds shift more out of the south down towards the south. And that's why the temperatures are a lot milder over Will, Kankakee County and out towards LaSalle County. Quiet on the radar scan. Overnight, though, some areas of sprinkles, mist, drizzle and fog in the forecast. And that's how we'll start our day on Tuesday. Tuesday. There's a look at 6 a.m. with temperatures in the upper 30s and low 40s. And then for tomorrow afternoon, huge temperature difference. If you're out in the far western suburbs, you'll make it into the low 60s, 63 Ottawa tomorrow, along with Joliet. But Waukegan at 49, Gary at 48, O'Hare around 50 degrees. Let me zoom in. I'll show you that big temperature difference even a little bit more with places like Winnetka at 48, Evanston at 48. And then you get out here towards uh, Palatine near 60, Schaumburg 60 degrees, Hyde Park at 48, the loop at 46, but mid 50s at Midway. Look at Oak Lawn at 58 degrees, Gary at 48 tomorrow, 44 at both Burns Harbor and also Indiana Dunes, but in the mid 50s down towards central areas of Lake County, Indiana. So again, closer to the lake, cooler it will be. It's a short lived cool down because the winds are back out of the south on Wednesday. Let me take it a Wednesday afternoon with high temperatures in the mid to maybe even upper 60s, even warmer than today for the middle part of the week. We'll hang on to the 60s on Thursday with the front coming in in the afternoon. That front will bring in cooler air behind it with highs actually closer to average for this time of the year, Friday and Saturday in the upper 40s. Front will also kick up a chance for some showers. Future radar. Here's a look at Thursday afternoon. Some showers passing on by. We think for the most part, this is going to be on the light side and with the disturbance down to the south, we'll have some showers around even on Friday. Some of the models are a lot wetter than this one, so we'll keep an eye on that. We'll put it right at a 50% opportunity for showers on Friday. Some areas of fog, mist drizzle in the overnight, 35 degrees by tomorrow morning. And then for tomorrow afternoon, cooler than today, we'll go 50. Again, that's going to be closer to O'Hare. It's in the 40s, closer to the lake. It's in the 60s out in the western suburbs. It's all about that lake breeze tomorrow. 65 on Wednesday and breezy, 62 on Thursday with a 30% chance of shower. Some lingering showers even into Friday and cooler at 48. And we'll go near 50 on Saturday, mid to upper 50s on Sunday with a partly cloudy sky. Brad? Albert, thank you.